what is going on. So I'm saying this specifically to TikTok and you know I think this message is super important. So I'm not gonna tell you you know to like just share it, but you don't you don't have to do that. Just even make your own video speaking about this topic because if you know not a lot of people are talking about this and what's going on in the media and you know the si the systematic racism is a part of something that I think is so important. I'm saying this specifically to TikTok because I talk about this often on YouTube, but I want to say it on TikTok as well. You know what I'm saying? Wherever you may be coming from, I don't I don't know where you may come from. I don't know if wherever you're from, whatever you see, whatever the people that you look to, you know, or look up to, you know what I'm saying? As to what you strive for, where you strive, what you want to be able to do, you know what I'm saying, in life, you know, whether, like, not even independence on race, I mean, I do know that when people do come from these areas that are impoverished and are dangerous, you know what I'm saying, and aren't the greatest places to be able to develop a healthy understanding of the mind, these are areas that, you know, is predominantly the black community that is placed to be in these areas, it's jacked up, but it's just the truth, and it's something that, you know, we can't, we can't blind and hide away, you know what I'm saying? And I just want to say, I don't know who I may be speaking to, whether it's, you know, a, a just young black kid who may not have the right influences or not have the right inspirations or maybe looking, you know, up to other people that, you know, he feels that he can relate to or he, she, whatever, you know what I'm saying? We see a lot of um just these young artists that make it out. They make it out, as we say, they make it out the hood, right? And a lot of the stuff that they talk about and promote and speak about, of course, as I see and that is truthful, is sinful. You know what I'm saying? They talk about, you know, like promote promoting treating women certain ways, promoting doing drugs, promoting a lot of different things that we know truly within our minds is sinful and is not cool, but it's the best, it's all that you know, it's all that you see, so it's what you talk about, you know, being a thug, whatever you speak, or drug dealing, whatever it is, you know what I'm saying, this is stuff that we see people speaking about, and um, it's their, it's like their occupation and stuff, or, you know, of course, all that you may see is basketball, right, because people, um, oh shoot, I'm getting a call, it's all good, though, people that do, you know, um, things like, like with basketball, right? I mean, a lot of it, you know, you grow up in that type of, you play basketball a lot, you know what I'm saying? I understand because I'm from that perspective in a way. And I just, um, I want to say, you know, this is why I, this is why I believe in God. And this is why I stick to my relationship with God, with God is because there is something outside of that. I just want to inspire you and speak to you today and say there is something outside of what everybody and what the media is trying to tell you. I know that, you know, within the media, all that we see is with these young successful black people this is just all that we see in the media is people that are doing these certain things speaking about these certain things and it's not and it's not it's not good it's not good stuff you know what i'm saying and that's not because that's like you know we like to promote stereotypes and say that's the way that black people are that's not the truth that's not the truth of the matter at all it's the fact that it's the way that i feel like the media wants for black people to be and to look like is the same ways of all of the biggest songs that we see all of the biggest black female artists that we see seem to be promoting their bodies and they want it's almost like they want to make black women seem like they are you know sex objects i'm just saying this is the truth this is what we see we can't hide from it we gotta say it is the truth this is what we see in social media and I'm just trying to speak it out today and I just want to say I don't know who I'm talking about young black men young black women or if I'm talking to somebody that might not even be black but just may come from an area a predominantly black community that is dangerous because this is just you know it, it's sadly where black people are born to be our, our place to be born and this is just how the society this is how kind of this country everything kind of seems to work as far as I can see and as far as how jacked up it is but you know I don't know who I'm talking to or it could be somebody just coming you know and not have the right influences inspiration listen with a relationship with God, with a connection to God, that does it doesn't have to be, listen, regardless, it doesn't have to be that, it does not have to be that, you know what I'm saying, you can be whatever that you put your mind, you can do anything that you put your mind to, you can do, you you can freaking be an astronaut, you can be a, li a librarian, you can be a scientist, you could be a freaking, you, you could be a, 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 a speaker, you could be a, what, what's examples of any occupations, anybody can do anything, you know what I'm saying, and it's going to be more difficult, you know, for people from certain areas that may look a certain, like, that's just the truth, but you know what I'm saying, I'm here to inspire and bring out today that you can do it, you can make it happen, whatever God puts on your heart that you want to do for the world, that you want to change and make a positive impact in the world, you can do that junk, you you right. You can do that junk. I don't know who. I don't. I don't. I don't know. I don't know you. You're watching me through the camera. I don't truly know you. But this is coming from somebody that you know has gone and thought that the wrong path was cool. Thought that the wrong junk was cool. You know what I'm saying? Thought. But listen, I'm telling you that it's not. And this is why. 
I pray. This is why I keep close to God because God allows for us to see past that, see past only the things that we can see in the media. You know, all that you can see in the media is these people promoting this sin. And these people that you look up to promoting this sin, that's all that you can see because that's all the media twists it to look like and be. That's all that we can see, right? You know what I'm saying? But we can almost, we can see past that. God gives us a vision. And with that vision, we can see past what all of this stuff in the media is. And we can have something put on our hearts that might look crazy to other people. You want to be that and don't ain't nobody make it ain't, ain't nobody make it into that who have you seen who have you seen that you know what I'm saying like comes from where we come from who are we who have you seen you know it might be the perspective who are you saying that looks like you that's ever made it in that position that we see who who you know some people might be telling you that but I don't care what listen with God all things are possible anything is possible and anything anything positive anything that you want to do you know what I'm saying in this life anything that you want to do overall it's possible it can and you know what I'm saying you're gonna make people proud you're gonna make incredible things happen and you're gonna inspire so many people you know what I'm saying to be able to make a change and make a difference in the world that we live in because, you know, I just don't, I feel like regardless, listen, I've spoken about it before, but I feel like systematic racism is still a, a kind of thing that we see, you know what I'm saying? And they're trying to, they feel like they're trying to tear down the black community and make it seem like, you know, it's like all this other stuff here, you know, if you're, it, it, I'm just saying it is the truth. I'm saying it is the truth because I'm trying to be honest. Like if you're white, it's like you see, you know, these other people, whether they're creating big companies, big businesses, you know what I'm saying? Like, you can see Mr. Beast, you can see Elon Musk, you can see whatever other examples that I could, like, say, right, that you see. But if you go, if you go and it's like you're, you're a black person that's looking at social media, it's like all that you can, like, see is, like, these people that seem to be talking about certain junk, like, it's cool because it's what, you know, you grow up around, it's what you see with, and it's like, it's just, I'm just trying to let you know here right now, it doesn't have to be, it doesn't have to be that, you know what I'm saying? We see, I, I'm not gonna like get too much into what I've seen on YouTube and stuff, but like in the LA scene, do you see the way people be carrying themselves? Do you see the stuff that people be talking about? Do you see the type of junk that people be thinking is cool? And like, what's the, uh, like, I, I would love to see more promoted, you know, like just black creatives on social media, but sadly we don't see it because it's not promoted on social media. There's plenty of them out. There's plenty of people. There's plenty. Everybody is out there doing being creative. We as humans are created to be creative, no matter what you look like or what you're. Not like that doesn't that doesn't impact that. It doesn't impact what 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 our creative abilities are. Now where we put them, sometimes it can be impacted because of what we see. Though you know what I'm saying. If you're if you're like, if you're black and you look and you see people that you have to look up to, you know what I'm saying? It, it's rough because of the way the media has twisted to make it seem like this is all that you can, this is all that you can do. This is all that you have to be able to do. It's rough. And it's like, if you're coming from a n different perspective, honestly, it's like, it, it, it's, it's, it's different. It, it's more simple to see just somebody else that looks like you and it's like, oh, they're doing that. You know, I can do that too. It's not as simple when, you know, I'm just saying specifically when you are black looking at social media, it's tough. It's rough. It's not the same and it's, it is rough and it's not cool, but it's the truth. And all that I'm trying to say right now, somebody's got to encourage it is that you can do anything that you, you can do anything that you put your mind to. And it doesn't matter what you look like, what you can see, who your influences or what you have, the only stuff that you have to look up to. It's It sucks that it has to be that way. Where that's all that you can see in social media. It sucks that it has to be that way. But guess what? That doesn't mean that that has to be you. And you can do some incredible, amazing, anybody can do incredible, amazing, beautiful things. That's all that I really wanted to say, you know. Hope this message got out right. Thank you and God bless you.